Well, let's keep talking about January 6th because the, the first uh, hearing is set for June 9th in prime time. And I'm wondering, what are you hoping uh, comes out of these hearings? And do you think the, these hearings will actually make a difference? With regard to the second question, will it make a difference? I don't know. You know, uh, I think uh, I, my concern is that people are so entrenched in their positions that, you know, some conservatives, Republicans will look and say, oh, this is all fake news. It, it, it's not real. It's inconsistent with what, you know, Donald Trump says. Hopefully, uh, you know, Democrats, liberals, progressives will be moved. Uh, and my hope is that those people who are, you know, uh, independent, um, and there's a substantial number of those folks, will will look at this with, um, you know, in, in a neutral way and, and be convinced or, or, or not convinced by what it is that the committee um, says. But what I think we're going to see is um, a, a conspiracy, the, the breadth uh, and depth of which is going to be truly shocking. Uh, we have seen leaks from the committee that give you a, a sense of what's to come. There's been great journalism done by you know people at the Post and 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 uh, and other uh, other outlets that give us more of a sense of what we are, are likely to, to see. And even what we know so far, I think, is is quite frightening to see that you had people at the highest levels of the White House engage with people at the Justice Department, aided by lawyers coming up with cockamamie theories, all designed to not have that electoral vote count happen on January the 6th, throw this, throw the election into the House of Representatives after you disqualified, uh, you know, three or four states electors and allow Donald Trump to consider to continue in office, even though he lost the election by seven million votes. My hope is that people will be shocked by that, alarmed by that, um, and demand that changes um, be made and that people be held accountable. Because if no one's held accountable, if no one is held accountable, there is no deterrent effect and it doesn't stop somebody 20, 30, 40 years from now from trying to do the same thing that uh, the Trump crowd tried to do uh, before and after January the 6th. 